Welcome to World in Two Minutes. Here are your stories. German President Joachim Gock has said he is considering Greece's demand for reparations for damages caused during World War II. He stated that he understands Greece's compensation claims and called on his country to examine the demands. According to figures presented by Greece's Deputy Finance Minister Dimitris Mardas, Germany owes the country up to 287.7 billion euros in reparations, 10.3 billion euros of which are forced loans taken by the Nazis. A bomb exploded outside a police station in the northern Irish capital, Belfast, making it the second bomb attack in the country in a matter of days. No casualties were caused by the blast as the police managed to cordon off the area after receiving a warning from a Catholic priest. Homes and businesses were evacuated as a bomb squad searched for the device before detonating it with a controlled explosion. Police said the bomb was large enough to have caused death and injury. According to the Syrian Observatory for Human Rights, U.S. coalition airstrikes killed at least 52 civilians, including seven children, and wounded dozens of others in the northern Syrian province of Aleppo. U.S. air raids also killed seven armed men belonging to groups fighting against ISIS and Assad regime forces. It appeared that the air raid struck civilians in a village on the eastern banks of Euphrates River in Aleppo instead of ISIS targets. The fourth baby who is in line to the throne was born at 7.34 GMT on May 2nd. The palace stated that both Catherine and her daughter are in good condition. The Duchess gave birth at the St. Mary's Hospital where their first child, Prince George, was born in July 2013. The name of the baby will be announced in due course. Thanks for watching. Efnan Bayraktar, TRTWorld.com, Istanbul.